you feeling? Very nice. Very nice. Which Malpe Beach. Now we are Malpe Beach. We are now in Malpe Beach. We are now in Bengal. 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 We are now in The next day in Udupi started with Kapu Beach where you find a lighthouse and the Kapu is located around 13 kilometers from Udupi and 45 kilometers from Mayanglo. It takes almost 25 minutes to reach Kapu from Udupi. It's been told us that the Kapu lighthouse opens from morning 5.30 a.m. to 6.30 a.m. But uh, unfortunately, we couldn't enter the lighthouse because the level had increased there. So The next spot was Kemenu Hanging Bridge near Udupi. This is approximately around 8 kilometers from Udupi and we can reach here uh, within 20 minutes. And this bridge is constructed to provide connectivity to other side of the river. The Kemenu Hanging Bridge connects Padukudru to Timmanakudru and this bridge is approximately 280 feet long and it was built in January 1991. There are 26 families residing in Timunakudru. During this monsoon river Swarna flows with bream. The region gets drowned when the water is released from Hiri Yadaka Bajeda. This is the only bridge which connects families residing in Timunakudru. <laughs>
the next spot was Delta Beach, which is also known as Kodi Bengre Beach, which is located in a small village of Kodi Bengre in Udupi. This is almost uh, 15 minutes drive from the Kemenu Hanging Bridge. The Delta Beach has a mini port of fisheries. Here the river Suvarna merges with Arabian Sea. This is roughly 9 kilometers from Udupi main city. The next destination was Malpe Beach. The Malpe Beach is one of the most beautiful beaches of Karnataka and it is just 88 kilometers from Udupi and which roughly takes around uh, 15 minutes, I would say. Uh, here, there's a lot of sports activities are conducted here and uh, one can also reach St. Mary's Island uh, through a boat and the charge for per person is around 300 bucks there where you get a chance to visit St. Mary's Island and you can roughly get an hour to spend there in the island and they'll get you back in the same boat to Malpe Beach. And you can also find a lot of hotels nearby. I would say the major attraction in Udupi is Malpe Beach. One should definitely visit this and uh, let's not waste time and see how Malpe Beach looks like.
this end of day two and uh, we have almost uh, covered all places in UDP and uh, on the third day we had to return to Bangalore. So instead of taking the Bangalore Mangalore highway, I we took an alternative route so that we can cover Marwente Beach as well. And Marwente Beach really looks beautiful. Hello friends, non videos in Vista, like, share, subscribe. Next video, I'll see you. Bye bye.